Connecticut's only airport is getting a major facelift. Today, Sikorsky Airport got $7 million to repave a critical runway. The airport is in Stratford, but Bridgeport actually owns it. News 12 Connecticut's John Craven says the upgrades could pave the way for commercial air service closer to home. We are at Sikorsky Memorial Airport. At the Bridgeport Airport. <laughs> commercial passenger service hasn't taken off since the 90s, but could it return? Potentially, there's definitely interest there. Airport manager Michelle Moyo is hopeful. Voting on item number 34. Governor Especially Obama. after the right. state just released $7 million to yes. repave a second runway. That's critical for any new service. This money is absolutely a wonderful opportunity. We're so appreciative. But excitement isn't taking off with everyone here. Some neighbors in Stratford still have noise concerns. Here in the Lordship neighborhood, they're also worried about traffic. There's accidents on that road all the time, so that really poses a problem. But at the same time, if I could catch a fright from there rather than going to JFK, that'd also be pretty nice too. Governor Lamont says Sikorsky can grow and be a good neighbor. I think Sikorsky has the opportunity to be a really important regional um, airport. I think uh, you see some distribution facilities there. We got to work with the neighbors. I want to make sure we get this right. Next week, Sikorsky adds charter flights to New York City on Tailwind Air. But the airport faces stiff competition. Tweed Airport in New Haven is adding new flights. And Breeze Air, which was planning to move to Sikorsky, has since landed at Bradley Airport. But Moyo thinks there's room for everyone. I don't think it has to be an all or nothing approach. You know, we, we each have our individual markets. But are there enough flyers to support more flights? In Stratford, John Craven, News 12, Connecticut. Sikorsky would also have to rebuild its passenger terminal to bring back service. Right now, there are no plans to extend either of the runways there.